Ladies and gentlemen, week two action continues as the Bowser Monsters host the Daisy LeBron Lakers. I'm Charles Wallace, of course, and I'm ready for another week of exciting CMBO action. Obviously, we had last week, last game's thriller of a matchup. Today, we will be sat inside of the castle. The Daisy LeBron Lakers will pitch first, despite being the away team. CMBL, we do things a bit differently as LeBron gets the first out of the game there. Up comes Blue Dry Bones. And the Daisy LeBron Lakers... Oh! Oh god! That's gonna be blasted center field high and deep by Blue Dry Bones, caught at the wall by Baby Daisy. There's the good chemistry on that field on display. Blue Drybone's one of the best hitters in the league. Babies, Baby Daisy and Baby Peach not hesitating. Able to make the right play. Two outs as up comes Boomerang Bro trying to crack this game open. Swing and a miss here. Oh, that'll be cracked and that'll be foul. Two strikes. Oh, and that's an absolute heater from Peach. Boomerang Gross swings out of his shoes. Daisy Blonde Breakers will take the ball. Bottom of the first. Bowser against Yode. And Yode. Oh, a fumble there. And Yode, not a Yode bomb, but a good Yode base hit. As Yellow Pianta will get on base, but barely, barely runs out. And Peach has four stars. Will we see a Misogyny Blast? Instead, we'll see a double play. Interesting decision there from Peach. Up comes Daisy now. Daisy right up the gut. Yode will take in the first run of the game. Good RBI there. And LeBron already winding up his swing. Oh, that will bounce! Whoa, I've never seen that one! LeBron James, my goat, shows off his ability to be creative, bouncing it off the big guy. And that will be quickly thrown out. Boomerang Bro hits a dance, and uh, as we head to the top of the second, Bowser on tap, and this Bowser Monsters team can hit. This is still a murderer's row of hitters. The Lakers have to be worried there, as Bowser will blast one up and he'll get on base. Up comes Hammer Bro. Oh, are we about to see a misogyny pitch? Hammer Bro not taking his chances there. So there's a good hit, good contact. Caught by Baby Peach, thrown to second. One out on the inning. Up comes Brown Critter. I'll have some good contact, but that will go foul. Caught by Red by Baby Mario. And two outs here. Up comes Paratroopa. Bowser's stuck at first. That'll be a good hit from Red Paratroopa. Advances the runner. Men at first and second for Paragoomba. Will we have a Paragoom bomb? Bounces off the glove of LeBron. That will be ruled foul. Oh, great play by Yellow Pianta there. Makes the dive to get the ball up to Baby Daisy. Good game awareness there, as up comes the babies for the bottom of the second. Baby calling the best hitter of the bunch for the babies. He will get on base. And Bowser, former Cy Young winner, one of the first players, I believe the first player actually, in MBL history to win both the MVP and Cy Young, part of that dominant undefeated Bowser Monsters team, and when you look at this game, you know, he hasn't been great today, obviously only allows one run, however that was just one inning, 
How much of this do you put on the field in? As Baby Peach tries her luck against the uh, the runners that or the fielders there, Paraguma lays the wood, and as we head to the top of the third, the weaker part of the lineup coming up. We'll see how the Bowser monsters react. Oh, and that is a great hit for Magikoopa. Magikoopa's looking too, and she's got it. Hell of a play for Magikoopa. Now up comes the top of the lineup. Here comes Green Koopa. And that will just take Red Magikoopa to third. Up comes Blue Dry Bones. Almost had a home run earlier today. Looks to add another. This time, hopefully, not getting stopped at the wall. So I'll be caught by Baby Daisy at center field. Up comes the three hitter, Boomerang Bro. Dominant week one performance. Had a quiet week two outing. We'll see him try to bounce back here in week three as he takes a pitch. And there's high and deep center field. And there's no doubt about it, that's a go-ahead home run for Boomerang Bro as he continues his phenomenal season. And there's not even a chance to buddy grab that. That bounces off the statue. And just like that, the Bowser Monsters take a 3-1 lead and crack this game wide open. Bowser sends that one high and deep into the glove of Baby Daisy. She jumps over the shell. And takes the bomb. That's a great fielding performance from her there. Two outs for Hammer Bro. So that will be a great hit by him. Baby Mario gets hit by the lava and he freezes for a second. Hammer Bro will get an extra base and we'll see now that he's in scoring position if Brown Critter can send him home. And instead Brown Critter will ground out into the rolls into the glove of LeBron James and Peach is tired. She's had a great game so far, but yeah, that might have, that should probably end her night. As up comes Yellow Pianta, caught by Blue Dry Bones, left field, Peach. No misogyny blast. That is interesting, as that'll be quickly thrown out by Boomerang Bro at first. Star grab from Boomerang Bro, and that chemistry from second to first has really helped them out as we enter the top of the round fourth inning. Daisy LeBron Lakers really neglecting to use their stars of that. We'll see how that affects them, but obviously that's not great. So there's a snipe with a green shell. We'll get red paratroop on for an extra base. Peach is very clearly tired. No adjustment. What is the manager thinking? There's a change up from Peach. Paragoomba swings out of his shoes there. That'll be a foul tip ball. Off the glove of Yellow Pianta. Men at the corners now, but for who? Red Magikoopa had an awesome line drive earlier this game. Can she continue it up? Here comes a misogyny swing. Pitch, excuse me. But no misogyny swings today. So, it's really interesting to see is there's a nasty curve from Ma Red Magikoopa, and she's had a dominant performance here today. Right where the ball needs to go. In slides, Red Paratroopa, and they're gonna bench Peach, but for whom? In comes Daisy, their closer, hopefully. This is a team that's made for the playoffs. They got good pitching depth. This is the bo the boo item. That's going to help him out. Buddy tossed to home, but the runners advance. Hell of a hit by Green by Green Goomba. Even better item there. His up comes Blue Dry Bones. Daisy's got to be careful. Flower pitch. Blue Dry Bones is just going to sit on that. Daisy's not playing any games. Another flower pitch. She goes three straight flower pitches. 
Blue Dry Bones just takes, just stands at the mound and takes it. Up comes Boomerang Bro. Home run earlier this game, another good hit. In comes the Boo item. That will crack the lead to 7-1, and this is just getting out of hand. Now Baby, now Daisy is tired. Up comes Bowser. She will go for one last flower pitch. And it's interesting, they should be using these stars on the offensive side of the ball, not the defensive side. As Bowser sinks one into left field, and we have an 8-1 ball game. They're gonna bench Daisy, but for whom? In comes Baby Daisy. So that will be foul, but barely. Hammer Bro trying to send Bowser home. Change up from Baby Daisy. Baby Daisy just trying to stop the bleeding, as that will be a strikeout. Up comes Brown Critter. Bowser isolated at first. That's a nasty star changeup. And Brown Critter sends that one into right field. Oh no, they don't have chemistry back there. And that will be a two run home run and they will add to their totals here. As this game gets out of hand here in the top of the wrap fourth inning. 10-1, and now Baby Daisy's tired, and they're gonna bench her. In comes Baby Peach. Now Baby Peach, again, part of this elite pitching depth, but what good will depth do you if you're already 10 runs in the hole? This finally the ending will end. Red Paratrooper grounds out. That was a seven run inning at the top of the fourth. How can the, the Daisy LeBron Lakers respond? My glorious king LeBron James will get to first with a base hit. They're gonna need a lot of those. Bowser throws a meatball. Throws another meatball. Oh, oh my god. My glorious king will get to third. Good base hit from Baby Daisy there. Up comes Baby Kong. So that will be a double play. LeBron just 90 feet from home plate. Baby Mario will get a base hit. My glorious king LeBron James will get home. That is going to be an RBI double for Baby Mario. Up comes Baby Peach trying to help complete this comeback. And she will. She gets on base, men at the corners. But for who? Yod, the top of the lineup is back up. And Yod cracks that one high and deep. Oh my goodness, and the item. The item takes advantage there. And Yod, with a Yod bomb, up comes Yellow Pianta, cracks this one high and deep. And that's a two run home run! Defense can't do anything about it. Bowser's tired. And just like that, they're within four runs. And another boo item. Not a misogyny blast, but same result anyways. Peach will get on base. Up comes Baby... Up comes uh, Daisy, sorry, I keep calling her Baby Daisy for some reason. So that will finally be caught by Blue Dry Bones. And that is a horrible, horrible inning for the Bowser Monsters, but definitely an entertaining one for us fans. 12 combined runs in the Rav 4th inning. And the uh, hitting spree will continue as Paragoomba takes base hit with the star ability. Koopa Magic. Does she have any tricks left up her sleeve? She does not, and that is a huge double play for the Daisy LeBron Lakers. As that will be a base hit from Green Koopa. Big hit. 
from blue dry bones that will go foul. I'll be another foul tip. And blue dry bones will strike out. And now in the bottom of the fifth, the Daisy LeBron Lakers control their destiny down four. And it looks like they're gonna bench Bowser. They're throwing in. They're throwing in their closer. Red Koopa Magic. Two for three today from the uh, plate. Looking to give LeBron some trouble. LeBron unfazed will be caught by Red Paratroopa. And Baby Daisy. Oh, fuck. Baby Daisy, what should have been a routine catch, will turn into a double. Baby Kong. We'll get on base through the gap there. Daisy will stay second. Baby Mario, huge RBI earlier in this game. That'll be fair. Baby Daisy at third. Baby Kong at second. Oh, oh, he's hit by the item. Bases are loaded. This could lead to a tie game. Yod. Oh, and that's going to be a heartbreaker for the Daisy LeBron Lakers. Yellow Toad grounds out due to that changeup. He was expecting a fastball. He was going to throw that thing into the moon, tie the game up, but instead, he will not. Boomerang Bro, his second ever MVP on the season. I believe the first ever repeat MVP on the season. And this is far and away his best game. 100 points. Or the best game out of anyone on the team today. 100 points in terms of batting. This was an efficient batting game. I mean, everybody was able to get on base. If we take a look here at the Daisy LeBron Lakers, good all-around team performance. Everybody can use. Everybody used their items, which is really something that you will need to come playoff time. That will end today's Week 3 matchup. Thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Peace.